This is just a <clears throat> backyard bulb tip of the day. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this little cooler or chili bin or esky, whatever you want to call it. And what we're going to do is we're going to put a 12 volt battery inside this. We've already put a cigarette lighter or a power point, whatever you want to call it, in the side. You can plug in your accessories there. And uh, we're going to take a garden tractor battery, just about the right size, and sit it in there. And what that will give you is a nice handy dandy little portable power pack uh, that you know you can power some LED lighting if you need you can charge your cell phone or any anything that works on 12 volts can be plugged in there uh, you could get a uh, small plug-in inverter they make them small the plug into your cigarette lighter and maybe make 100 watts or 150 watts if you needed AC electricity uh, and then if you want you know what you could do is get yourself a little solar panel and hook up a small solar panel to this and have it outside in the sunny area and have the Sun recharging it while it's sat there so there's a lot of little things you can do with this but uh, we're gonna go ahead and fit the battery in there so we've gone ahead and put the battery in our cooler and we'll just show you what that looks like. So there you go. That's just a standard, uh, I think it's UL1, could be UR depending on where you want the positive and negative terminals. A uh, little battery fits right inside that cooler. It's not too heavy, uh, not too bulky and they put out a uh, I don't know that one is 215 cold cranking amps they make one that's that's um, 300 cold cranking amps I think or 325 same size we have our power outlet in the side just make sure that depending on how your stuff is wired most of the time it's center the center lug in the power outlet is positive and the uh, the ground goes on the framework but uh, that's it and we packed a little foam in the front and on the sides to keep it from flopping around you got to make sure that you leave enough clearance down in this corner because your power socket is going to stick back into the cooler a little bit and the wires are on the back so that's why we have the battery shifted off to one side and shifted to the back but that makes a nice little portable power unit um, you know, if the kids are camping out in the backyard and they want a little bit of light, um, you can get some really trick uh, LED lights that don't really draw too many amps and put out a lot of light. Put a, uh, a power plug on the end, it'll plug in there and put that in the tent with them and they'll have all the light they need. Uh, and you can then just recharge it with your home charger or put a solar panel on it, whatever you want to do. Uh, and Bob's your uncle. There you go. Backyard Bob, tip of the day.